Hey you guys, I'm here today to tell you a little bit about a br one brand new piece of specialty paper that's in my Honey and Spice collection. Now you might not be able to see this very well because this is white paper, just has a beautiful embossing texture to it. So the embossing is actually words. It says things like, today's a good day, love your life, let's adventure, time to relax. And it goes on and on all throughout the whole page. It's really hard to see. And I kind of wanted it that way because I really wanted this to be a surface that you could have fun with. So I'm gonna go ahead and kind of show you one way that you can get the words to really pop. So I'm gonna go ahead and just cut a small portion of this paper. And what I have here is just a little bit of acrylic paint and a makeup sponge. So I'm just gonna go ahead and just kind of get a thin layer of the acrylic paint and I'm just going to cover the whole on this side of the paper I'm just going to kind of cover the whole thing all right so what's interesting is that when you do add a little bit of color it gives it kind of a different feel with the texture so you might be able to see that um, there on the camera so the other thing that you can do now that I've kind of gotten a lot of the paint off you can go over this and just kind of lightly hit the highlights. You can do this with ink or with this kind of paint effect. And you can see that as you just lightly go over the top, it'll hit the high points of that embossing and kind of give you that smudgy, distressed kind of a look. You can kind of play with that as well. All right, I show you that while I'm waiting for this side to kind of dry. So now that this is dry, I'm gonna go ahead and just take a little piece of sandpaper and just lightly sand over the top of it. You can see as I sand, those words and those letters really kind of start to pop out. You could sand that as much or as little as you'd like. So let me just show you here on this project that I made, right there on the first, on this front page, I just covered the whole piece with a little bit of acrylic paint and then just hit the top, hit the high points with the sanding paper. And what it does is it just gives you this really cool texture and really interesting look. All right, so that's just two fun ways that you can play with this embossing paper to make pretty stuff.